Hey guys! Okay, I am going to display a video for you guys that describes the DCPIP test for vitamin C. You can also call it the DC PIP test. Um, so this video depicts a food test for vitamin C. So hopefully this will work. I'm gonna I'm trying to minimize me and just let y'all watch the video. So give me just a second. DCPIP or DCPIP to test for the presence of vitamin C. Fill your test tubes up with DCPIP without your samples present in them. Then add your samples into a drop at a time and shake as you're doing it. The DCPIP might turn pinky purple first, so this is because of the acidity and doesn't reflect vitamin C being present. Keep adding your sample and shaking. If vitamin C is present, you'll notice that your DC pip turns colourless. Repeat this process for each of your samples. When we make a final comparison, we can see that the fruit juice is the only one that has turned the DC pip colourless. So, we use DC PIP to test for the presence of vitamin C. We add our sample to DC PIP while shaking it, and the DC PIP will turn colourless if vitamin C is present. Okay, so you could see in that food test, since this liquid turned colourless once the DC PIP was added, that means that vitamin C was present in this test tube, which it contained fruit juice, which pretty much all fruit juice, uh, the ma majority of all fruit juices contain vitamin C, and that's the vitamin C food test.